Hello everyone, this is Yakuro with another UFO tutorial. In this episode, we will look into the U property macro and cover the following specifiers. Blueprint assignable and blue, blueprint callable. Uh, those two specifiers are used in combination with multicast dynamic delegates. So in the blueprint level, that would be like creating event dispatches. Let me show you an example. But first, um, we will start the editor. We will use this basic actor class. And before I start doing this in the C++ level, I like to show that how it works in the blueprint level. Just a second, almost done. Okay, so let's create the blueprint version of our class. And the event dispatchers can be created in this section here. So we could say, do something that's the name of the event dispatcher and let's say it expects an input a string and now our example is going to be we will spawn this act into the level and after around five seconds we want to call this do something uh, dispatcher so let's put a delay here just a walk around and then we say call hello world what else <laughs> okay i don't have to save this actually and let's open the level blueprint spawn actor from class um, just spawn always and just a zero transform now what was the name do something now we can assign here function uh, event and that's it ah, why do I press always save so after five seconds we should see this message on the screen hello world How do we achieve this in the C++ level now? For that, we will use uh, multicast dynamic delegates. Let's use the one with one parameter. Do another thing. And then we want to pass an F string reference and it's going to be a message so now we have our delegate and we want to expose this to the editor using blueprint assignable and blueprint callable so the blueprint assignable will uh, do this um so usually when you call the delegate or event dispatcher you will see this assign bind call and so on those two specifiers are adding those functions so assign and call
So let's go back. Blue print signable and blue print callable. Let's compile this. Okay, so now you will notice that in this section, even though we selected the show inherited variables, we don't see our delegate. To see it in this field, we have to add here visible anywhere, for example. But that it is there, I'll show you in a second. Uh, do another thing. Here's the function. Add the delegate. Another hello world. And let's use here the visible anywhere flag as specifier. Then you will see what I mean by that. So the visible uh, specifiers we covered already in one episode, so feel free to watch them. Um, to understand how they are used. Now you should see here this my actor field and we can see the event dispatcher we did in the C++ level. So we can drag it and call as we did here already. And now let's bind this event dispatcher also do another thing. So let's assign and print out the message. So we will see two messages, messages on the screen. Why do I keep pressing save? <laughs> I just wonder. Another hello world and hello world. So that's it for this episode, I think. Um, if you have any questions or suggestions, feel free to leave me a comment. Um, else thanks for watching and hopefully seeing you in the next episode